Hello guys, if you like my awesome gaming videos, my programming and web development courses, my editing courses and editing videos, and my tech talks and tech guidance, then you can consider subscribing to my channel and click on this bell icon to stay connected with me all the time. This is a very important video for you guys. So today I got a new update in Windows 11, which is version 22000.71, which is the latest build of the dev version, okay? So we got a new changes and new things and new features and some bug fixes that I'm going to talk about in full detail, okay? So if you want to know more about, I'll give you a website link of Microsoft official. So this is the link, as you can see, Windows Insider blog. Here you can read the full article where the main changes are, okay? I will show you everything in demonstration purpose in this video. So first the changes is that when you right click on it, as you can see, your refresh button is really looking nice and there is an icon of refresh. And look at this context menu, as you can see it's a nice translucent effect and it is portraying the, in the background the wallpaper. If I change the wallpaper, as you can see, if I right click and change the wallpaper, and now as you can see it is showing, the context menu is showing based on the background and it is have a nice glass effect and the blurry effect which looks really nice because in the previous version which is 22000.65 the contest menu was really dark and it doesn't look so good based on this wallpaper now it has nice acrylic effect uh, which we have in this terminal as well as we can see so this kind of effect is added on our context menu so our next feature is on our widgets now if you click on add widgets you can add new widgets which is entertainment if you click on it and I'm going to closing it as you can see we have a new entertainment widgets okay you can drag it you can drop it in any positions okay so this is very important and you can also slide it to show what's under what's next as you can see we have a nice entertainment section and if you click on this you can also remove this widget so this is one of the main widgets that added in this particular build so let me show you the personalization setting and go to our system and show you the version that I'm using so if you go to the about section as you can see our version is 22000.7 which is the latest build okay and one more bug fixes that we have is if you click on this icon in the and double click on this security icon this virus and threat protection it was turned off by default by but now it's turned on when you even restart your computer it will be stayed turned on okay so which is very very important because if we turn off this virus and threat protection it will be really vulnerable to use windows okay and another feature that is added if you right click on this sound icon okay sound icon we have troubleshoot and sound problems okay you can troubleshoot it so this is the new added in this windows latest update build so another feature that is added is the preview if you right click on it right click on your apps as you can see it you will see the recent everything that you have if you right click on this to do application as you can see we see everything and it also have a translucent effect as you can see the background blur effect as well so if you hover over any application as you can see you can see the preview of that application if you click on it you can see this so as you can see i'm just hovering over it and i can see the preview and another bug fixes that we have uh, when we just transfer one apps to another place and change their position like this this app opens automatically but in this build this is fixed we shouldn't open this app when you drag their position okay so this is also really nice addition so windows is really working very hard with it and giving us nice little updates that we want and everything looks really beautiful if we go to the personalization okay if you go to the personalization and if you go to the colors in the previous uh, build when you change the uh, this theme to dark to light as you can see i'm changing it it is changing automatically and very quickly but in the previous build it was a little bit of buggy it took a lot of time to change this uh, mode okay uh, so normally i don't like this light so i'm changing it to dark again as you can see it is really really fast so in the previous build that was a little bit of buggy and slowness and another thing that i have seen the changes when you click on windows and tab as you can see we have different kind of tab if you uh, if you can change it very quickly and easily we you can have new desktop and as you can see we can change everything very quickly and as you can see there is no bug at all it is completely fluid and awesome there is no problem at all it is very fluid so another one if you hover over your application as you can see you can see the preview of your application and it is rounded corner previously it was not rounded corner as you can see the preview was not rounded corner 
but now it is complete rounded corner so this is also very good so there is a lot of bug fixes that is uh, completely fixed in this application in this build and new features like entertainment and this awesome looking context menu everything is added which is really really nice and the, the problem is that we you just drag it and it, it is not launching so this is also very nice addition so Windows uh, is doing so Windows 11 is pretty good in this particular moment it is fixing a lot of bug and there is no major problem whatsoever and the lastly I want to show you the uh, performance table if you click on the stars manager as you can see the CPU just is very low memory just a little bit on the higher side because I'm using Chrome if you don't use Chrome the memory would be like 25% uses which is pretty good and uh, everything is all right and the cpu is also not that high it is manageable and it is very quiet and awesome everything looks pretty good up to till this moment of windows 11 okay so thanks for watching i'll be coming with a lot of amazing content in the near future so till then take care bye bye i'll be coming with the next video